Hey guys, so it's time here to have a look at the Galaxy Note 3 versus the Galaxy S4. So today we got the new Galaxy Note 3, so let's compare it against the S4. So it's a little bit like the same, I mean, overall you can say that the, the Note the phone here from Samsung is like a, a better and bigger Galaxy S4. But let's, there are some more details here. Of course, here we do have the S4 came out this year, Gal with, uh, along with the Galaxy S4 Zoom, the Galaxy S4 Active, the Galaxy S4 Mini, and so on and so forth. So, what is cool about the Note 3? Well, first of all, Falk's letter back here. Uh, the cool, you can see here that they removed the plastic back and replaced it with Falk's letter, which is like fake letter, but it still looks dope here. You can still take off the back, so they will probably be a lot of companies that will ship out a variant of the Note 3 uh, or like a plastic back. I mean, definitely you will be able to purchase that on like metal and aluminum and all those kinds of materials. You can see also um, some other interesting things here. If we take a look at the S4 here, I almost do believe that the S4 could be a little bit more rounded off on the sides up here at the top and at the bottom compared to this little fella which looks a little bit almost like the, the, the edges looks or the curves looks almost very, very identical now to the iPhone uh, in, in the sharpness of them uh, if you look at it compared to the Note 2 I mean it's, it's a major 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 difference you can also see that the camera or the sound speaker is not no longer at the back it's at the bottom now of the phone which I'm really not sure how, how that gonna work out but uh, so let, let's compare them first 4G network you will get this new LTE advanced technology inside of the uh, uh, Dino 3, I'm not sure if it's going to be well on all variants, but I also do know that there is an S4 variant that will have that, so that's faster LTE for you. Uh, but it, it's not going to be available for uh, for all regions and all places and, and all those things, though. Uh, let's let's move on here. Uh, the dimensions, as I said, on the new Note phone, same as the Note 2. Uh, of course, it is bigger, 5.7 inch display compared to Samsung's uh, Galaxy S4 5 inch. Uh, 1080p displays, of course, on both it shouldn't be any difference there, but uh, about 7 inch bigger. 168 grams versus 130 grams. Uh, the the thickness here, though, uh, the S4 is a little bit thinner, uh, but not super much thinner. The they really made some improvements with the the thickness on the Note series here, going down from 9.4 millimeters to 8.3. Uh, also what's exciting here is that they will, I'm not sure if it's going to be Gorilla Glass 3 on the Note 3, but it's probably going to be that technology. Uh, but one thing here that they've changed is that um, they won't like ship a 16GB variant of the Note 3, it's only going to be 32 and 64, which is good because it's going to address one of these is issues that people had uh, with the S4, the, you, when you bought the 16 gigabyte variant, you only got, got a few gigabytes, like six or seven gigabytes, and that will empty out pretty quick if you download high-end games. You still have micro SD card support and removable back, which is nice, so you can remove the battery, hopefully. Uh, three gigabytes of RAM also, so it's the first phone with three gigabytes of RAM. It's not, this is not gonna make a big difference between that and two gigabytes, probably not. Uh, the 30 megapixel camera on both devices, uh, but you can record in 4K video, which uh, sounds pretty interesting. That, I think that's like four times the resolution of uh, 1080p, that you should be able to do that on the you Note know, 3 compared to the S4, that you shouldn't be able to have that feature. Also, video that you record <clears throat> 1080p at 60 frames per second, the LTE version, that sounds pretty cool for me because I don't want to suffer. Some some phones have problems recording 1080p even like 25 fps. At least that was what I did see and struggle with last year. Uh, they probably have improved that though. A uh, 30 megapixel camera, as I said, on both. Uh, we also do get updates uh, in the end, uh, the OS version. At least here in the beginning. Uh, the Note 3 is going to come September the 25th globally uh, with the latest version of Android 4.3 Jelly Bean and of course Google have unveiled this new version of Android Android 4.4 KitKat <laughs> yes KitKat that's the name um, that uh, they, blah, 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 blah. Google ha haven't said anything about KitKat 4.4 so we'll probably see more updates about that in a few months but uh, once the Note 3 here is going to ship it's going to have Android 4.3 and the S4 is going to get Android 4.3 and also the S3 uh, is going to get that in October next month. Uh, 
Q is shifted here. Uh, you go from Snapdragon 600 if you have the global variant to Snapdragon 800. I'm not sure if there's a super big difference between these, but at least it, it, it's uh, the G CPU here is high clock, clock at 2.3 hertz, uh, create 400 uh, versus create 300 clock at quad 1.9 gigahertz. Uh, and then also they will have an octa core variant of of the of the Note 3, which is going to be clocked at 1.9 gigahertz. So it's four A15 cores and four uh, Cortex A7 cores, which should save some battery, but um, I'm not sure in the real life. Uh, the GPU also the gaming thing is better going from around 320 to 330. Not sure if you will be able to notice a big difference though. Then of course we do have these things that it, it has Fox letter on the back, which is exciting. Uh, that you, I mean, if you don't like it, you, you can probably just replace it with a plastic back or something. Because definitely there will be probably companies that will think about that, especially if the demand is high for people just really not like it. But I think majority of people will like it. Uh, the battery also only 100 more milliamps than the Note 2, uh, but definitely more milliamps here in the battery compared to the S4, going from S4 to 2600 to 3200, but 100 more milliamps only uh, from the Note 2 to the Note 3, uh, but still they probably made some software improvements, so uh, you will get a little bit better performance, maybe 20% extra battery, uh, which is also pretty good overall. Uh, so as I said there, a uh, global launch there of the Note 3 is going to come September the 25th and then in the US and Japan it's going to come out in October. So you're looking forward to this? Uh, I am definitely looking forward to it. Wow, um, uh, this is awesome, this is amazing, this is great and uh, I, I just want to have it and hold it in my hand. Uh, so hopefully you enjoyed this video, if you did please leave a like and hopefully I will see you all in the next video. Peace out.